Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel, Pisces Soul Tribe. So listen, you guys, I feel like I need to get into a love read. Um, something you can possibly expect from love. You know, it's been a while and like, I know Pisces have been in a space where they have been, you know, working on themselves. They have been grounding and like, I feel like you're in a good spot now where you possibly want to date and where you are looking to step out of, of hermit mode or um, all of the introspection that you guys have been doing. So I want to get into a read. I want to thank you guys so much for the likes, the shares, for commenting, for subscribing, for all of the support and love that you guys have given me. Anything you need to know about me will also be in the, in the description box. If you're looking for personal readings, if you need a, a, a birth chart and you want to dive into that, all of that will be in the description box as well. If you would like to donate as well, all of that is in the description box. So, you know, let's get into this read. Spirit of the Most High Angels, Ancestors, Ascendant Masters, Higher Beings, um, messages for for my Pisces soul tribe for what they could possibly expect when it comes to love and you know are, are we ready for it spirit we bind and cancel any attacks and we return those negative attacks and we return those to the sender tenfold so that we may be edified uplifted and encouraged so let's see i'm seeing the six of pentacles at the bottom um of, of the deck which is success so maybe there's a new scenario that you have just entered in and you're wondering if, you know, is it going to be successful? You're getting good vibes with it. You guys are getting along well. There's good conversation. Um, there's a lot of common ground. Um, I see that there's a lot of conversations, especially with the six of, um, not the six, but the knight of swords um, at the bottom of the deck. But I keep on seeing the six of pentacles as I'm shuffling. But let's see, what does spirit got for us? Spirit, what is Pis something Pisces can expect when it comes to love? Okay. Wow. Um, what a way to start. Um, Ten of Pentacles, man. So abundance, um, family, generational wealth, um, success, um, stability, major stability. Spirit, what else? <laughs> that was actually a pleasant, pleasant surprise. So let's see. Wow. Um, this the sun and justice. Yikes, you guys. Mm. I feel like something's coming in to possibly balance you out. And if you don't have it already, but I'm also getting a sense of this may be your karma, but like on, on, on the side that's favorable to you. Um, Some of you. OK, I'm not going to say that. I'm going to wait. <laughs> what else? We got spirit. Um, the Knight of Cups. I see some of you guys dating, like you're you're in though in in the dating stage. I feel like you're 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 exploring. Um, you're having fun. Let's see what else we got, Spirit. Two of Wands. What else we got, Spirit? up oh, but we do have victory wow with the tower and the two of of, of pentacles hmm So we have the Ten of Pentacles to to the Two of Wands, which I'm not I'm not surprised about. I feel like somebody's uh, put put something into action, but I definitely see the Sun with the with the Two of Pentacles. You may be possibly enlightened with something. Something has been revealed to you, and like I feel like with with what with what has been revealed to you, you're now making the necessary changes to in order to get what it is you want. But I'm also see, see getting a sense of some some type of balancing. But this is unexpected for you with the justice and and the tower. Like I I feel like this is something that you that you don't expect 
uh, you know, see coming. But I do maybe possibly see in some type of maybe maybe institution um, happening here as well. But I'm seeing dating being really, really successful for you with the Knight of Cups to to the Six of 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 um, Wands. Spirit, what's the Ten of Pentacles to the Two of Wands? Okay, we have the um the Prince of Wands. I feel like this is something that you that you're you are really passionate about. I feel like you you've done your research. Um I feel like you've gathered the necessary information that it is that you need in order to express maybe some type of message um to someone um about passion and maybe maybe you're maybe you're setting ground rules or but let's see. What's the um what's the Prince of Wands spirit? The Two of Wands and okay. Wow, um, it's the Ace of Cups. I I feel like you you're in a space where you where you're where you're wanting to express your joy and your happiness, how fulfilled you are with this new dynamic. Wow, with the with the universe at the bottom of of, of the deck, it's like you you have total access. Like you you feel like this person puts you on top of the world. This is nice. What's the Ace of Cups, Spirit? The Four of Cups. But I'm not getting a sense of boredom with this. I feel like there's a, a settling in. Um, and you're getting you're you're getting comfortable um, around each other. I feel like it's, it's, it's such a comfort that you all can just sit around and laze about in a house you're 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 happy with just being comfortable amongst each other and even if maybe like in this in this particular imagery like somebody could be on the phone or and that wouldn't even bother you much you're just happy to be in each other's company yeah spirit what's the four of cups okay But I'm also seeing the the three of swords. I I feel like before I say that, spirit, what's the what's the three of swords? It's the queen of pentacles. Something is, I'm I'm getting a sense of 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 maybe some possible disappointment from a mother figure and i'm getting a sense of honestly this may be a far outlandish reach take take the message as it as it resonates i feel like the fact because I'm, I'm 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 getting a sense of um an, an lgbtqia um couple here and i'm getting a sense that some mother is disappointed by the union ship and like i feel like that this mother may possibly be disappointed because you know in traditional sense like you know there's multiple ways to have children but like i feel like this mother is is, is this mother figure is disappointed at the fact that she may possibly not have any grandchildren um because you are gay and like I feel like it's possible that she may feel like the family family dynamic may be ruined now um because of that and like I'm also getting a sense that you are the only you are her only you are her only child mm. hmm spirit one more what's the what's the queen of this why is she why is she in pain why is she heartbroken Yes, she feels like something is risky, like something something's happening very fast, and 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 you're it, it just feels like risky um risky behavior. Hold on, you guys, I I need to figure this out. Like I'm I'm just wondering why. Spirit, what's the risk? Why, why, why is, why is Mama moving in quickly? Like, what's, what's going on here, Spirit? What's the Eight of Wands to the Fool?
Yeah, it, 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 it's the death. Like, I, I feel like she's... Spirit, what's the death? Here goes the father. And why is the queen of... um Not the queen. The king of co um coins here, spirit. The emperor... One more. What's the what's the king of okay? There's some sense of confusion here. Yeah, like somebody. There's a lot of change here, cause from the deaf to the the king of coins to the emperor, and like I'm getting a sense of 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 she's confused as to how much you've changed and and. You almost you're almost not recognizable to her. Like this is not who you grew up to be as a child. It's such a it's such a far departure from what she knows you or what she thinks she knows you to be. And like I feel like there's just this grave disappointment with 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 what it is you're do what you chose to do with your life. And like, I feel like it's almost a sense of versus you like, le like, okay. So the queen of pentacles to the death, to the king of coins, to the emperor, this is about legacy. And like, I feel like in a sense, let's just say um, the father passed. I feel like you were supposed to take the father's place, but you being who you are and stepping into who you are as an individual, you like, no, nah, I don't want to be like daddy. I'll, I want to do this. Like I'm, I want to be an emperor. I want to build my own life. I want to stand in my own place and stand in my own manhood. And I want to be who I want to be. I'm not going to be who you want me to be. And like, I feel like it just has your mother confused because like this mother figure, she had, she had a life for you that, that she wanted. And like with the tower at the bottom of the deck and notice the tower is already on the board as well with the tower. Like this is, this is her, her hopes for you, her world, your, her world for you come crashing down. I know that's going to be very specific. So take the message as it resonates. Spirit, what's the sun to the two of coins? We have the Knight of Wands. Spirit, what else? What's the Knight of Wands? Will of Fortune. Like, I feel like there's a the change here is very significant from the sun to the two of pentacles to the Knight of Wands to now the Will of Fortune. Like time also here is is very relevant as well. It's almost like whoever people knew you to be as a child and whoever, like, I feel like some of you are about to live your, live your childhood dreams. I know this was supposed to be a love reading, but this has got taken a full out turn. And once again, I feel like, you know, I feel like you are dating and that's at the end with the Knight of Cups to the Six of Six of um, Wands. But I feel like the journey of getting there has been quite interesting. I feel like there's somebody here who is really going after what it is they really want to go after that though those wild outlandish dreams like the night the night of wands to to the will of fortune i feel like some of you are, are are once again taking taking that leap of faith and and you're trusting that what it is you're going after and what it is you're what you're doing is success because this is something that some of you all have been wanting to do as a child and like i feel i'm getting this sense of family not really supporting you and family having these expectations of you that you don't really have for yourself and you're going after what it is you're going after and I'm getting a sense that honestly there will be be some luck with it you know the knight of wands in this particular deck he he's a rock star you know what are the odds of being you know a musician in this world now nowadays it's all it almost feels like it's slim to none but I don't I don't I feel like with the two of pentacles 
circles um, and, and you know, being that small amount, I feel like you're willing to take that risk. You're willing to take that chance and you're willing to build on something it is you want. And like, I feel like you, you made your peace about it with the, with the two of swords and you, you're putting it into action. Spirit, what's the will of fortune? Spirit, what's the will of fortune? This is too many, Lord. Spirit, come on. <laughs> Can I get one? Spirit, what's the will of fortune? Okay. Yeah. It's the high priestess. Uh, it was Pisces. Pisces energy, of course. Like, I feel like you're... you're you haven't revealed this to the world as of yet, but like, I feel like you're getting to a point where you are about to reveal it. And like, I feel like honestly, people are really truly expecting, expecting you to fail. But like, I feel like there's an abundance that's about to come your way with what it is you're executing. And like, like, I feel like there, there's going to be victory with it. You are going to have success with it. Spirit, what's the high priestess? What is it we know that we haven't revealed? Uh, as I said, you are about to reveal that thing, but I feel like travel is also significant. You see the airplane just feels like London bridges, but I feel like this is something that's possibly going to put you in front of a lot of people. Um, almost getting a sense of somebody being um, world re renowned and that's the reason why you're going to be doing a lot of traveling but I also be, I'm also getting a sense that somebody's about to speak up and somebody's about to say something um, you have abundance at the bottom of the deck with the three three of cups like I, I see you know anytime I try to talk about love it turns into the love for what it is you want to do versus it being the love for, for somebody else one more spirit what's the ace of swords okay you are about to complete something and this is going to be great for you. As I said, you you are about to have major success. You are reaching major milestones. You are doing big things. These ideas that you have that you're that you're keeping to yourself. Um I feel like you're keeping them to yourself until you know like absolutely that you're going to have completion and have success with it. And it's not even to throw it in anybody's faces. This is for, this is for you. This is definitely for you. It feel, if it honestly doesn't feel like um, anyone is involved as well. Hmm. Spirit, what's the justice to the tower? Um, seven of cups. Somebody is um really enjoying themselves. But honestly, I feel I'm getting a sense of some player energy, honestly. Like and I feel like with the tower coming in before the the 7 of cups cuz the 7 of cups is in this particular deck is debauchery. And like I'm getting a feel and a sense of honestly some some destructive behavior and it's almost feeling very karmic to be totally honest like i know that justice is about balance it's about what's fair it's about what's true um it's about lessons learned and things like that i feel like there possibly is a lesson that has been learned here and it caused a lot of a lot of upheaval because somebody might be you know Involving themselves in some some risky activity. Spirit, what's the seven of cups? Okay, the temperance. Like, I'm getting the sense that somebody's risky behavior needs to change. That's what I'm getting the sense of. I feel like you've been under the geist and the protection of the divine, but that divine intervention can only happen for so long because that's what I'm getting a sense of, of this is what it is. It almost feels like divine intervention, especially with the lovers um, at the bottom of the deck. I feel like somebody needs to change their ways with the lovers, the temperance and the seven of cups. So think about it. The lovers, let's just say this is about marriage and this is about this, you know, about that, you know, getting that happy end in the family, right? The seven of cups to the, the temperance. Temperance speaks about um, change, alchemization. Seven of cups, you know, let's just say hot girl summer. 
I feel like you need to change your behavior from the hot girl summer to some, a behavior that puts you in the position so that you can have this. I'm not saying that there is nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with, you know, a good time. Like, let's be honest, who, you know, depending on who you are, like it, nothing wrong with a good time. But I feel like some of your behaviors need to change because that's that's what I'm feeling. Spirit, what's this? Um, what's the temperance? The four of swords. Yeah, you need to calm the hell down and sit down somewhere or go let down. You need to do something that puts you in a in a space where you aren't, you know, out there like that. And as I said, no judgments, of course. But I feel like you can't expect to have, you know, the husband or the wife and you're out here. As I always say, fucking every time Dick and Harry. No judgments. I'm just saying. I'm only reading the cards Six of pentacles Yet again success Spirit for um, four of swords What I tell you Five of pentacles But somebody's Somebody's worried about something Mm. Seven, seven, seven of swords at the bottom of the deck. Somebody is worried about a secret coming out. Somebody is worried about a secret coming out. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. See. I think somebody's behavior is catching up with them. And we still got the tower at the bottom of the deck. How interesting is that? Oh, Lord, don't nobody want no two towers in the spread. I'll tell you that truth. Spirit, what's the five of pentacles? Okay. Oh. Yo. -ho -ho. Yeah. Um. Mm. <laughs> Eight of swords and the fool. Somebody's behavior has been risky and they're worried about it. The eight of swords to the fool. Somebody's sick. Somebody's worried. Somebody's worried that they might. Somebody's worried that they might have something. It's too. The seven of swords at the bottom of the deck. The eight of swords. To the fool, the fool is taking a risk, but I'm getting a sense of some type of risky behavior. I swear to God. Spirit, <laughs> I hope I'm wrong. I really do. I really do. I don't wish that on nobody. Spirit, okay. Spirit, what's the what's the eight of swords to the fool? Eight. The lovers. I feel like somebody feels like they possibly ruined their chance to find find real true love because of their behavior. The chariot, temperance, nine of wands, king of swords, king of swords. King of Swords and the Queen of Swords, I know they're a pair, but they're also called the divorce couple. And then if you're divorced, you, you know, most times you single for a minute. But like, I feel like somebody feel like they ruined their, their they ruined a happy ending or, 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 or some type of dynamic because of their risky behavior. Spirit, what's the lovers? Okay, spirit lovers. The judgment, y'all. I swear to God, man. Like, I've... Yo. Okay, one more. Then I gotta move on, spirit. What's the judgment? The judgment and the justice all in the same room. Queen of Pentacles. I feel like you might have dodged a bullet. 
whoever you are, thanks be to God. And I really, truly do mean that. You just, you dodged a bullet. And like, I feel like you were, you were worried about it. You went and go did what you needed to do. And, you know, let's just, let's just say the judgment was the test results. Okay. And like, I feel like you came in with a sense of relief. Like granted, the queen of coins is all about, you know, the, the abundance, the stability and all other stuff. But like, I feel like somebody can breathe again and they're feeling grounded again. And there's honestly a sense of, you know, change, changing your ways after something that terrified you. Thank God. Spirit, what's the Knight of Cups to the Six of Wands? Okay. Five of Wands. Spirit, what's the Five of Wands? It's the Ace of It's the Ace of Discs. So I feel like I'm getting a sense of of you know there being there being like almost like a tug of war you know when it when it comes to when it comes to the night the knight of cups six of six of wands five of wands to the ace of ace of pentacles ace of disc like i feel like somebody's been tossed to, but toggling you know with starting over starting that stability starting that ground and get judgment at the bottom of the deck again like i feel like somebody's in a space where they where they've been wanting a date they they found success success with it um i feel like you guys are having a good time and like i feel like you because you know most times the, the five of of, of one yeah five of wands is about you know competition but i'm getting a sense of friendly competition i'm getting a sense of of having fun and doing things that you guys enjoy and like i feel like you are finding success with it and you find finding success with that has put you in a place where you want to start over where you want to start new and fresh with you know with some something that stabilizes you both together and like i feel like it's a good idea to start with the with the ace uh, ace of disc it's a great place to start because it's fresh, it's new, and you can decide where you want to go from there. Spirit, what's the um, Ace of Disc? Okay. See, um, Prince of Prince, the Prince of Disc. Like, I feel like this is somebody once again who who um, who is calculated. They do take risks. They, 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 this is the day trader. Like they, they move money all day long. They, they know how, they know how to move it. They know when to stop. They know when to go, but there, there's a certain timing um, that happens with it. But I feel like with the three of uh, pentacles at the bottom of the desk deck, this is like really strong grounding energy. And like, I'm getting a sense that, yeah, the three of, of pentacles to the nine of nine of wands uh, with the six of cups and then with the three of, of three the three of cups like there's major uh, the universe you got i don't even think i need to finish this with the ace of wands and then with the judgment again um and then we got the devil at devil but you know i'm getting the sense you know in this particular moment the devil ain't gonna feel like y'all you know lusty behavior and like all the other good stuff spirit prince of disc nine of swords of pisces pisces this feels like self-sabotage it really does it's giving me it's giving me self-sabotage please don't sabotage this I feel like this is really good and it's like don't 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 overthink this. I feel like you're overthinking. I really do. Spirit nine of swords. Prince of Cups. Um here's one thing that's definite and for sure. The Prince of Disc and the Princess of Cups. I'm not saying y'all don't match. And I'm not saying y'all can't be a pair, but I mean, let's be honest. This ain't this ain't a pair. It's too it's it's too different. And like I feel like maybe that is the thing that's stressing you out. Like maybe you feel like it's too different. It's like y'all have fun and y'all have a good time together. And you do feel like this would be something that 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 would be worth investing in. 
But then there's also a sense that you guys may be too different. Because your match is at the bottom of the deck with the princess of disc. She's the match is here. Okay, let's let's keep going. Spirit, what's the princess? Princess of Cups. The Princess of Wands. Some okay. This too many people. And then we got the Prince of Cups at the bottom of the deck. This is way too many people. But wait, mm. Spirit, what? Mm. I'm sorry, y'all. This is this is really interesting. This is taking quite a turn. Spirit, who is this Princess of Wands? On the moon. Somebody ain't somebody some somebody ain't being um somebody running around. Somebody running around. Now granted, this is this is just dating. This this does somebody's doing some shady stuff under under un, in the under the geist of the moonlight. Somebody got some damn secrets. Spirit, what's the moon? Eight of Wands. Um, somebody about to speak up, and I feel like it's this Princess of Wands, especially with the Knight of Swords at the bottom of the deck as well. Um, I think she about to tell somebody about to get in trouble, and then the Tower. Oh my God, this is about to cause some sudden upheaval. I I feel like whoever this Princess of Wands is, she's about to reveal herself. Spirit, what what is she? What's going on, Spirit? Um, six of swords and like I feel like with whatever is going to be spoken this is going to put you P Pisces in a space where you're going to move on you're going to move forward from this and maybe that's the thing that that is the thing that has you had you stressed out with the nine of swords there's multiple people here this prince of, this prince of disco ho and he got, excuse my lane, he got multiple bitches. I'm sorry, Pisces. I thought this was going to be a good love read, but damn. Spirit, what else does Pisces need to know? That's, that's wow. You have a new love coming in, period. With the ace ace of cups coming in, and I feel like it's gonna be something that matches who who you are um, as an individual. It's gonna be very very emotionally fulfilling for you. This is a mess, and like I feel like that's the thing with dating. Like with dating, you never really truly know what you're what you're gonna get. And honestly, I I feel like if there is a sense that you is possible, you need to move forward. I say use your best judgment and put that judgment into place. And if you gotta move on, then you just gotta move on. Sad, but I mean it is what it is. I feel like the best place right now for for most Pisces. I'm not gonna say all. Um, for most Pisces, is just to invest inward. Spirit, what's, why is the Ace of Cups here? Oh, wow. The Hierophant. The Ace of Cups is here because there's a new higher level of commitment coming in for you. And, like, I'm get, honestly, I'm getting a sense of... Um, if, is it possible that this may be your soulmate, your, your twin flame coming in? But let's see, Spirit, what's the Hierophant? Why is the Hierophant here? The Hierophant is here. This is something that you don't see coming. Um, it's unexpected. And like, once again, there's been a lot of that with the divine. Like, you know something's coming, but you can't quite put your hands on it. It's almost like you can feel that love coming, but you don't know where it's coming from. You can feel the block with it. You can feel the energy, but you can't feel the energy. Spirit, what's the tower?
the nine of swords this is this is this is causing you some great deal of insomnia and like i'm not even getting the sense of strongest i know this card is intense but like i get someone just sitting up late at night wondering when is it gonna come like when is it when is it happening and it's not like as i said it's not like a strong thing it's just more it's more passive where it's like what can i what can i expect when can i expect this to come like but you let's see nine of wands okay y'all ten of cups This is going to happen when you least expect it, Pisces. So I'm I'm going to say it. Don't stress yourself out. W concern yourself with something else. Like work work on you continue to work on yourself. Continue to work on your passion, your hopes, your dreams. Um get that fulfillment that that it is you want from yourself first. And then then, you know, just be patient and wait. One more. Spirit 10 of cups. Knight of coins it's coming it's coming but it's coming slow uh, it's grounding energy if you want something stable and something that's gonna last it's gonna take some time with the knight of coins okay um well you guys that was that was the read like i hope that in some capacity once again this was um helpful to you and hopefully hopefully the details resonated if it did resonate like share comment subscribe i would love to hear you guys story and once again anything that you need from me or want to know personal readings donations or anything else will be down below in the description box pisces enjoy this day and conquer it okay bye guys